Um, yeah, let's, let's give these guys that double road. It links in with this one quite nicely as well, so. Yep. Okay. Uh, we'll put some road in. Nice buy, more traders. Uh, no. In fact, you know what? I'm just going to get rid of this. Um, am I? Yeah, because uh, what little seeds we need left, we'll pick up at these two. And I'm, I'm just sick of constantly getting binged, told to look. So let's top these guys up. Yeah, okay. Um, well, Chandler's, obviously. Now, yeah, where are we going to put these guys? Where can we fit? Can we fit a few in here? Hmm. Yeah, we couldn't have fit them in even if we hadn't put that double road in going along here, so. Yeah, good question. Where are we going to put these guys? Well, not necessarily there, so you can stop. Um, well, I'll think about it at a later date. Let's go over here and uh, carry on prepping for the canal. Okay, no, I don't like that. Let's let's take that up there. This one's done, I think. That tree's not on there, is it? No. So yeah, let's at least finish off this canal and get it joined up. So yep, yeah, just throw a load of these down. So we'll get a bit closer and then we'll just hang fire and because uh, what we will want to do is put the gate on first and then we'll allow that to show us where the corner join is going to be and prioritize get this one done there's enough of you although saying that i mean this is right in the corner of the map so they've got they've got a bit of a trek um yeah what's going on down here um for around this lake i was thinking if maybe yeah doing a bit of terraforming maybe putting some um shipyards on something like that uh, so yeah i know we need lumber for that so i might just throw in I might just throw in a sawmill. Now, what do we need for that? Oh, yeah, we need funny things, don't we? Will it fit on the end there? Well, I think it will. Okay, well, yeah, in. Uh, building supplies. Okay. Well, we'll let that um, sit there for the time being until we work out to <laughs> get building supplies. How's our little outdoor wedding venue coming along? Uh, it's looking good. Yeah. What does it need? Some flowers, maybe. What do 
be like. Wild Lavender. Red, I don't think Red Lama, no. Um, pink Leafy Bellflower. Yeah, yeah, why not? Let's throw some of these down. And I think the uh, yeah the white uh, Asiatic is that how you pronounce that? I don't even know. I think that contrasts quite nice with uh, that sort of luscious pink. So yeah, let's throw some of these down as well. Um, two, three. Some more of these pink ones. Pink green leaf is quite nice as well. It's not as not as dark as that pink. Um, yeah, let's have some going down the aisle. I guess we'll just have to walk around them. And yeah, should we put anything in between the trees? Yeah, maybe some more of these. Yeah, okay, very nice. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to take these any further down. I think this uh, is enough room. And uh, it gives it a nice sense of proportion. There's a bit of open space for people who are late to stand at the back. Um, but yeah, that looks quite nice. Okay, so well, that's uh, another thing to tick off the list. Um, yeah, let's just try and keep on top of this, get it done. So, yeah, let's see what this is like for putting in an eight way gate. Where would we want it? So, we want it as close as possible without it clipping, so. I'm thinking probably somewhere like that. Um, yeah, let's throw it in there. And does that look about right? Yeah, I think that's going to be about right. Mm. Yeah, do I want access to this? I was thinking we could we could use some of those sort of towers, or or maybe. Yeah, this type of this type of sort of fence, and maybe put a little outpost as it's the first. It's the sort of first place where when the boats come into into the region, so in like a lookout or something. So I think just in case we decide to do that later, I'll probably throw in a little bridge around here and then just leave it all as straight because there's no real reason for any fishing or anything along here, not at the moment anyway, unless we do anything close by with this section so yeah enough yapping let's uh, let's get building douche 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 and bridge yeah you know what I'm gonna I'm gonna put a fishing dock in anyway just because if I do put like a little look out there at least if you don't have to trek too far to, to get some food so throw that in and then just carry on all the way up dozy 
it's it's twice as bad when you make a mistake using this because you know that you've got to come out of the menu and go all the way back through it again just to to get back to the piece that you want so annoying twice as much okay Get rid of that little line. Yeah, we're getting close to using this corner piece, so let's give it a go. Try and get it lined up. Um, yeah, it's that way. It's got to be that, hasn't it? Yeah. So, will we get another piece in here? I think we will. And yeah, just the use of one little filler piece. And let's mark all this for getting done immediately. And then that should allow us to uh, to have a have the, the traders come down and uh, hit these two trading posts. And what do you want? Walnuts. Um, no, food's uh, really good, so no, let's take walnuts off. God, there's so much stuff in this uh, trader's inventory. Um, there you go. Go away. Right, what's your problem? One. Trader. Oh yeah, because I destroyed your home, didn't I? Okay. Yeah, let's take that down then. Four. And get rid of that little bit of road. Don't need you anymore. Right. Um. Well, we've done a bit. We've uh, we've got these houses up around here. Uh, we need a centerpiece here, don't we? Really. Let's. Um, yeah, we're with Bangor Church things. We haven't got, actually got any normal style churches, have we? So, and I am a big fan of uh, that model. I think it looks quite good. It's probably going to fit in quite well. So yeah, let's throw this in. Let's get it lined up. Take it back. As long as I can fit a road in. Yeah. Oh, hold on. Yay. Okay. That works perfectly. Yeah, it's sort of dead spaces, which I'm not too happy about, but, well, can't really do much about it. Um, yeah, let's use the uh, standard blacksmith and tailor here as well. Let's throw a couple of these in uh, and then we can upgrade them because I think the, the upgraded buildings will look quite nice. Throw him in there, and let's get the tailor on the go. Um, if I'd select it correctly, I was going to say it looks a little bit like the uh, the blacksmith. Okay, douche. Right, they're down. Um, while we're upgrading stuff, let's because I keep forgetting otherwise to keep upgrading these little town abodes. Oh, no, where's that not building? Ooh, I need stuff I haven't got. Yeah, there's quite a number of different sort of production lines um, 
available to me with all these mods. So, uh, yeah, there's stuff that I haven't really done. Furnishings. Let's um, let's try and get some of those on the go. Um, yeah, got to do some of that over here. Well, anyway, let's have a look at our canal. Wow, so close. I always instinctively go to this menu for uh, prioritization. I don't know why, but uh, yeah. come on, track over here and get this done. And let's turn this guy off if we can. Yeah. Yeah, I think that gate's okay. Looks all right. It's quite close to the shoreline, so I'm quite happy about that. Um, we're literally just waiting for this to get done. And it's really not far away. And then, yeah, so then we've got, we've got the link to the main river and then we can utilize these two traders. Yeah, let's give you a uh, priest, cleric, whatever you want to call it. Um, And um, yeah, where do we want? I still want to put some of those uh, chandleries in. So I'm just going to throw some down and then sort of live with it uh, a little. See how it looks. If I can find the appropriate menu, there we go. So yeah, do I want it this way? Do I want to put a couple in here? Just have to spin them around. And this way. Hmm. Yeah, no, I'll just put a couple there. And it gives people a reason to come into this section. Traders are going off left, right, and center. No. Oh, yeah, well, yeah, let's have some of these. Let's just take 10 of each, not be greedy. That'll probably still be pretty expensive, won't it? What's that? 4250, yeah. Okay, so we've got those. So uh, the J statue will build by itself because we've already placed that. Uh, in the center and then yeah this is this is pretty much done now the gardens are pretty much done although yeah I was wondering why the water was dark it's just the shadow <laughs> of the old wood trees or the green boy trees um, yeah let's set these two to upgrade and Let's put some guys in the channel is. Um, yeah, I think we're going to leave it for now for this episode. Uh, predominantly because I forgot to look at the time when I started the episode. So I don't know how long we've been going for. But, uh, oh, look at this. Yeah, our distilleries have been built. Brilliant. Yeah, I think they look pretty good. Yeah, because they've got this sort of little space to the side, I think it was a good idea to leave a little gap here, just so there's a differentiation. A little bit of a space between both the distilleries and the uh, fuel refinery. It was still okay for firewood at the moment, even though this guy's using it up, so... Let's start one of these guys off, what we're thinking. Uh, yeah, well, we've got figs in, haven't we, so... Uh, so, yeah, fig, glassware and furnace fuel, so we've, we've got some glassware in the bank, I think. Decent amount, I think. Um, yeah, two and a half, two seven. So let's turn this guy off, and then let's just let this guy roll for a little bit. Maybe shove a couple of guys in there. And yeah, we really need to get on with some uh, tobacco production, don't we? And uh, get a curing barn in and 
get some uh, get some gange on the go. Oh look, our cathedral's done. Very nice. Look how tall it is. Yeah, so it's sort of buried in a forest at the moment, which is not what we want. Um, yeah. That's that's high. Um, yeah, we're going to want to obviously landscape the, uh, the area around this. So I think as our last act in this episode, we'll just mark everything. This end for destruction. And then... I'll probably just let them collect this and then when we get back we can jump straight into doing some more stuff around here. So uh, so yeah, I'll uh, see you in a bit.